Delta Airlines has struggled to recover from last week's global tech outage. Some passengers spending days in airport terminals unable to book flights or find hotel rooms. And here at Muhammad Ali International Airport, we've seen 13 cancellations. Now federal investigators are looking into these ongoing disruptions. Chaos and growing passenger outrage as Delta Airlines struggles to recover from that global IT outage. The major Delta flight disruptions now in their sixth day, leaving lots of passengers stranded at airports. This is our fourth cancellation. I just wish I, we'd given up and stayed home. The U.S. Department of Transportation saying since Friday, Delta has canceled more than 6,000 flights. The airline now the subject of a federal investigation. We estimate that more than half a million passengers have been impacted by this. There is something unique to Delta uh, that requires specific attention. In a company memo, Delta saying they're seeing day over day progress and quote, teams are working around the clock to reposition planes and people to where they need to be so we can return to normal operations by the end of the week. Rochelle Akufo saying Delta canceled her and her daughter's flight to London. The airline rebooking them with a layover of more than 340 hours. The math is not mathing. Like in, in, in what world would I have a two, a two week layover? And this morning, Delta issuing a new statement saying in part, quote, Please accept our sincere apologies for the disruption to your recent travel plans caused by a vendor technology outage affecting airlines and companies worldwide. And this is the best the Delta ticket encounter has looked in days. Delta now offering affected customers 10,000 bonus miles, and it says it plans to reimburse them for reasonable expenses. Faith Abube, ABC News, Atlanta.